What's going on guys, it's your average consumer, and you know Ari. Hello. And today we are going to be checking out 2018's LG Gram. Huge shout out to LG for sponsoring today's video. And for sending me something, I never get sent things, so yeah. thanks. Lucky you, huh? <laughs> but today we are going to be taking it out into the real world, but first, we're gonna unbox it. Oh, you're late. I'm, I'm not as much of an expert at this I'm just gonna are. breeze through this without <laughs> you. A 15.6 inch laptop. This thing's mm. pretty light. Can I see yours? Yeah. Yeah. That's one thing really I love light. about the Grams. The LG Grams are super lightweight, but they're still durable. So if you're like me and you just throw your laptop in your bag, no case, you should be fine. All right, so besides the laptop, we've also got our power adapter. Plug this guy into the wall, give your laptop some juice. And we've got our ethernet adapter so that you can plug this up to an ethernet cable. Uh, it's USB type C. Oh, nice. And uh, pretty much that's all you get in the box. Lightweight laptop. Lightweight unboxing experience. <laughs> <laughs> now, in terms of the specs between ours, oh. Oh, I that's like, cute, look. <laughs> I like that my little clock here says 15. And mine says 13. That's so yeah, cute. Yeah. So they pretty much look the same, except you have a full on uh, yeah, number I've got pad my over number there. Yeah, pad, you know. <laughs> Uh, I also have a Thunderbolt 3 port, mm -hmm. uh, which is something you don't have. Yeah, I feel like I wouldn't need that though. I, don't, I never connect any of my laptops to an external monitor. Yeah, like, ever. yeah, I do. So <laughs> that's great for me. Also, this, they both have fingerprint scanners. Where? Which are on the actual power button. I like that. Yeah, that's so smart. you know, that's, that's smart. the logical place to put a fingerprint scanner, I think. Uh, mine is a bit more spec'd out because it is the larger laptop. That's okay. But, <laughs> but other than that, they're pretty much the same. Cool, so let's get to the fun part. Let's actually take this thing out into the real world and see how it works. Let's do it. So obviously we were very impressed when we held the LG Gram with the unboxing, but I think you could really appreciate how light it is when you're actually using it. So here it is in my purse. I don't know if you guys, we won't see it poking out, but this is it in my purse. I could easily throw it in my purse, throw it on my shoulder, and it is super, super light. Now that's different from my other laptop. I have a laptop and it's 13 inches also, but it's super heavy and I cannot use it with my bags at all because it digs into my shoulders. So I have to resort to an ugly backpack. At least with this, I can like, you know, still look kind of cute and not have my shoulder hurting me. Honestly, I'm just surprised you could fit anything else in that bag. <laughs> <laughs> and even though I'm not carrying some purse every day, you guys know how I am about my backpacks and how crazy heavy they get. So it's kind of nice to have something light for a change. All right guys, so something that's actually pretty exciting to me about the LG Gram is the fact that it's going to make this backpack, which is historically very, very heavy for me, uh, it should make it much, much lighter to carry around. Now comparing this to some of the stuff I typically use, it is a major, ooh, I don't even wanna mess around with this. It is a major, major difference. I feel like this is nothing, this is hefty. And we're gonna see how it does. So I've got it in here. And let's see. This is nothing, guys. Woo! Oh, that's nice, that's nice. Now, I, I, I don't usually complain about having a heavy backpack because that's how I do it. But I gotta say, the grass is kind of greener, guys. This is nice. And not only was I impressed by how light it was, you're gonna hear that a lot, <laughs> but I was also happy that I could just work with it outside in direct sunlight with no problem. Okay, so common scene, I'm in the car getting some work done, but I wanted to just show you guys this really quickly because even in direct sunlight, I'm still able to see the screen, it's bright enough, and I'm able to do all my tasks without any kind of like distraction from the sun or anything like that. So if you are a commuter, someone constantly on the go, Ooh, sorry for the bump and ride, folks. <laughs> Even if you're someone constantly on the go, you're, you'll be fine with this and be able to do your work really easily. Yeah, that kind of brightness is great for outdoor use, so if you're someone who likes to get work done outside, this is definitely a good thing. And honestly, guys, I cannot stress enough how comfortable it was working with the Gram. I'm not the kind of person that likes to do work at a desk or anything like that. I like to be on a couch, on a rug, you know, just kind of comfortable with it. Uh, and the Gram made it pretty easy to do that. So in this next clip, you're gonna see me. It's kind of like not the best quality, so don't judge, <laughs> because I had to shoot it at night, but I had to show you guys just how comfortable it was to use it in bed. Hey guys, it is like 12 in the morning. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I'm on Pinterest. Uh, Jed and I actually just bought a house, so it's pretty empty in here, as you can see. Uh, so it's only right that I'm on Pinterest, you know, getting some design ideas and all that stuff. Here's Jed, knocked out. He's probably gonna kill me when he sees this, but you know, I gotta put him on blast. <laughs> oh, and we're in, on an airbag, guys, so no judgments, you know, new house. Uh, but yeah, I decided to pull out the camera because I never, this is a very rare sight, I never ever have laptops in bed with me. I don't like having them, they're too heavy, it's just like, just not fun. I'm usually on my phone doing this stuff. 
Um, but, you know, this gram is actually nice to have in bed um, since it's so light. I know we keep harping on that, but it is, and it makes it easier to, to have in bed. Uh, and it's also nice having the bigger screen. So this is actually a situation where I'm not opting for my phone and I'm not mad at it. So yeah, I just want to show you guys that since I know Jen and I are doing like the real world usage right now. And this is a perfect example of how, you know, it's nice to use. And there's a backlit keyboard, which is definitely a plus since it's dark and Judd does not like having a bunch of lights on. Now, Ari did a great job touching on some of the features of the 13 inch model and the 15 inch model, but I wanna talk a bit more about the specs and some of those features that you won't see on the 13 inch model, like the Thunderbolt 3 port. Now, one of the differences between the LG Gram 15 inch versus the 13 inch is the inclusion of a Thunderbolt 3 port. And I've actually got this one hooked up to this monitor right here. This is the LG Ultrafine 5K monitor. I've always been a fan of these displays, but it's just nice to see that it also works with this. I don't have a lot of computers that do. Uh, so it's just nice to have. I have Adobe Premiere Pro open right now. And one thing that I'm actually liking on the performance side of things is that it's actually able to play this footage with a few effects and transitions just to mess around with it and it's doing it pretty well it's doing it at a half resolution which is actually pretty okay for 4k uh video file, so I'm liking that right now. Now another thing that makes the LG Gram 15 a bit different is the inclusion of this number pad here on the side. It does switch up your keyboard quite a bit. Uh, it does feel a bit more cramped to me, uh, but having access to this is a nice bonus. I've used a ton of 15 inch laptops and none of them feature this here, so it is a nice bonus to have. There is a slight learning curve, so you will it will take some getting used to, but overall, I do prefer to have this here than not. And as you can see, if you wanna be able to have this whole setup with your laptop like I do, then the 15 inch model can definitely deliver on that. But if you want to have something a bit more simple like Ari, the 13 inch model works just fine. All right guys, so right now I've got on some Fortnite. Uh, you know I had to do it. Uh, you, this isn't a dedicated gaming laptop. I wouldn't try to play anything hardcore on it. But if you wanna play something casual like Fortnite, you can definitely do that here. Now, this isn't on the highest settings or anything. This is probably around medium settings. I think this gives us a pretty nice in-between of uh, smooth gameplay and uh, decent a decent look. Dang, 76th place, that lasted no time. Uh, but yeah, guys, as you can see, it's, it's still pretty smooth. We can play just fine. Casual gaming, definitely what you can do here. Nothing too serious. And one welcome change with the new LG Gram is the webcam is actually placed at the top. So that is the more traditional spot. It's easier to make that eye contact rather than it being at the bottom. So this is a better spot. And this is actually the webcam right now. So you guys can see the quality and the audio that you get from it. And while I have you guys here, let's talk a little bit about the battery life. Uh, this Gram can get up to 16 hours of battery life. Me personally, I got around eight to nine. Uh, you guys know me. I got the screen on full brightness. I'm playing my games. I'm doing all kinds of stuff on this. So if you do less intensive things, your mileage may vary. And as with most laptops, you're gonna be able to customize the specs of your device. Both of ours share the same processor. While I had 16 gigs of RAM, Ari had eight at one terabyte of storage while she had 256, but they actually worked out perfectly for what we use on the everyday basis. Ari does a lot more web browsing and emailing and stuff like that, pretty simple task. While for me, I want to be able to play games and do some of my work. But overall, guys, I think it's safe to say that we like the LG Gram. Yeah, and I have to say, I really do like that there are three different models. You have the 13.3, the 14 inch, and, and 15, 15.6. So, yes, yeah. so you get to choose your flavor, uh, whatever size works best for you. You have that option, which yeah. is great. And I'm not the kind of person who's like gonna go out and buy a super specced out laptop that I'm not gonna use. Oh, God. So I do like that there are other models, like the 13 inch, that doesn't have maybe all the spec out things that his has, but it has everything that I need for myself at a lower price tag. But that pretty much wraps it up for this video, guys. Let us know if you wanna see a one month later video with mm -hmm. us just using it completely for an entire month. But yeah, let us know if you guys are interested in that, and we'll catch you in the next one. Till then, it's your average consumer, and Ari, peace.